Truly I say to you, one of you will betray me. He who has dipped his hand in the dish with me will betray me. You know the story. We make reference to it every time we celebrate the Lord's Supper. Our Lord Jesus Christ in the night when he was betrayed. Now notice that Jesus never says who the one is who is going to betray him. When Judas asks, Jesus only responds, you have said so. Not Jesus, it's Judas. Judas has said he is going to betray Jesus. And after he betrays Jesus, Judas goes out into the darkness and ends his life. Don't stop with that one disciple. Jesus said, remember, he who has dipped his hand in the dish with me, they'd all dipped their hand in the same dish with Jesus. Every single one of them is implicated in this betrayal. We always single out Judas, but what about those others? Remember St. Peter in the courtyard of the high priest? Three times he denied knowing Jesus. Three times he betrayed Jesus. Peter runs out into the darkness of sin. Back up a few hours, this is where Judas, the betrayer, comes with soldiers. Matthew says that one of the disciples makes that valiant effort to slice the throat of the mob leader, but he cusses, misses and cuts off his ear instead. That scene ends in utter betrayal. Then all the disciples left him. All of them. Every last one of them betrays Jesus and disappears into the darkness of sin. Do you ever leave Jesus and betray him? I know I sure have. Every time we sin, we betray Jesus and the forgiveness he has gifted to us. Every time we fear, love, and trust in something other than God, we betray Jesus. We leave him for the things of this world. We run into the darkness rather than confess Jesus as our Savior and Lord. There is hope for all who betray Jesus. Remember, Jesus ate with every single one of those betrayers. He gives to them the gift of himself in bread and wine. His body and blood shed for the forgiveness of all of their sins, your sins. You who have betrayed Jesus, he gives his body and blood to forgive you. All of your sins, every one of your betrayals. Don't go running out into the darkness when you betray him. Come to the place where Jesus has promised forgiveness, life, and salvation. Take, eat. This is my body. Take, drink. This is my blood shed for the forgiveness of all your sins.